Have you seen these dancing videos exploding on your Instagram feed? Well, there's two ways to make them. Let's get started. Hey guys, my name is Om and welcome back to my second video of the day. These Instagram videos, although simple, do take a lot of time as you have to do them frame by frame. So well done to the person who's done them. These videos normally call for a graphics tablet, but if you don't have one, no worries, use a mouse, which is what I'm using. Fire up After Effects and load the video into the comp. From here, click on the brush tool on the top and select the color and brush size you want. Then click on the duration drop down and click single frame. If you can't see the brush tab, click Windows tab on the top and make sure the brush window is selected. Double click on the clip and make sure you're on the layer tab. Now, I'm going to do a little drawing frame by frame. Yeah, that's right, every single frame. Make sure you move forward every frame and don't waste time drawing everything on one frame. Once you're done, right click on the timeline and select a new solid. Make sure you leave the color black. Then copy and paste all the brush strokes from the clip into the new solid. This is so we can add more effects. Make sure you're at the beginning of the timeline so the keyframes match up. You can now either turn off the brush strokes in the clip or delete them as we don't need them anymore. And change the blend mode to screen. From here, go back to the comp and add a glow effect. And adjust the glow threshold to 20%, glow radius to 80, glow intensity to 1, and copy and paste this effect to intensify the glow. And you're done! That's the first one out of the way. The second way is slightly simpler. I'm going to go back to my original clip and draw in a different area. Grab the pen tool this time and draw a mask around an object in the clip. You can go back and adjust it. Create a new black solid again. Again, copy and paste the mask into the solid and delete the mask from the clip. And change the blend mode to screen. From here, apply the stroke effect onto the solid layer. In the stroke, we're going to turn on the stopwatch and we're going to keyframe it at the beginning from zero to where you want the animation to end, 100. Here, you can see the animation working. Highlight the two keyframes, right click and click Easy Ease. Open the graph editor and put the, click on the last keyframe and drag it in to give it a pop. Again, add the glow to the layer with the same settings and duplicate. And you're done! Again! Thanks for watching guys. Like I said, this week I hit 132 subscribers. Please hit subscribe as I'd love to get to 150. As always, hit the like button and the subscribe button and I'll see you next week.